Hi, wonderful people. Good morning. How are you all doing? Hope you are, hope you are fine. Yeah, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Fishing. In this channel, we talk about spiritual things that will help your life. That will help you grow in life. That will help you achieve your goals in life. Please and please, if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please help me and subscribe, like, share, and don't forget to comment. Please, don't forget to comment. Don't forget to drop your comments, and don't forget to subscribe on that YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click on that notification bell so that anytime I bring out a new video, you'll be the first to be aware of. And God in heaven will bless you. Amen. And to my dis return subscribers, I say thank you. I love you. Patient is telling me thank you. 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 And God in heaven will bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. So today I want to teach you a very wonderful and simple spiritual work you can do to boom your business. Are you lacking money in your life? Are you lacking money? Do you have a shop that you don't have goods? You don't have goods to fill your shop. You don't have money to buy your goods. I have a very wonderful spiritual work for you to do. This spiritual work will help you get money. This spiritual work will allow men and women to begin to favor you. Those that forgot you, this spiritual work will make them to remember you. Those that did not regard you, this spiritual work will make them to regard you. Those that, did not, that don't want you to have testimony, when you do this spiritual work, you begin to have testimony. When you do this spiritual work, you will never lack. Do you have somebody in mind that you want to ask money, but you are, you are afraid? When you do this particular spiritual work and asking for money, he will give you instantly. He will not even drag with you. He will just say, send me your account number, if you believe. Believe me, if you believe, you will see testimony. So, wait and see what God will do for you. So the first thing we are starting with this spiritual work is candy. We all know candy. Candy is not an evil thing. God himself created candy. Sorry about that. God himself created candy. Candy is light. When somebody is in darkness and you use candy to pray, darkness will be taken away. Darkness will be taken away. If somebody is in darkness, things are not working. When you use candy to pray, your way will be open. So I have come to use these three items. I've come to use these three items to teach you today. These three things. I want to teach you how you can use it to attract money to yourself. Instant money. Instant favor. Instant joy. Instant blessings. Both home and abroad. When you have somebody in abroad that is not doing well, give him this. Give him the spiritual work to do with faith. His way will be opened. Believe me, when you do it, you have testimony. The first thing we are starting with is Saint Michael perfume. This is it. This is the original Saint Michael perfume. My own is almost finished, but this is it. It's very expensive. So if you if you don't if you cannot afford this one, you can go for the little one, the one that has the white cover or yellow cover. It has different different type, but this is the original one. Hmm? And the second one we are using is candy. Candy is light. Candy brings joy. I will teach you how to use this candy to set a trap for your enemy, but not, not in this particularly channel. Not in this video. In another video. And the third one is Bintu Sudan. You all know it. Bintu Sudan is a very wonderful oil. Is a very, very wonderful oil. It's a wonderful oil that when you use it, you begin to have joy. It attracts favor. Being to Sudan, bring favor. It will make men to fall in love with you and help you. It will make men to give you what you want. If you're a woman, you have not, you have not gotten married, and you use soon, soon, uh, being to Sudan to rub in your face, believe me, that man that you're looking for will come to you. If you're a businessman, you don't know how to get money. You've been to Sudan, you have money. So I have come to teach you how to attract wealth. 
instant world to these three items. That's what I've brought today. So the first thing, we are starting with this. This is candle. We are starting with candle, yeah. But in this candle now, I have a name on it. So I have a, a name for it because I, I want to use it to do prayer. So I'm just showing you people. See how you are going to use it. You are going to turn this candle like this. Let this candle, you see it. It's going to face you like this. You're not turning this candle like this. Hmm? You're not turning it like this. But you're turning like this. You're going to write your name. The person's name is on top already. There's a person's name on top. You cannot see it. But you're going to write your full name on this candle. Then you turn it to the other side. You write your full name on this candle. Your name must face the edge of the candle. The mouth of the candle. Your name must face it. You write your full name on the candle. Then you turn it. You write your full name on the candle. You are going to write it three times on it. Then you drop it. It's seven. You are going to get a pack like this. This is a pack. At inside this pack, you are going to use seven. Seven out of it. Hmm? I, I cannot open it because I want to use it for somebody. So it's seven pack. You are going to you are going seven candle. You are going to use. So out of that seven now, all the seven candles, you are going to write their the names. Your name. This this is how you, this is the mouth. So your name will face this mouth. You start from here and write your name. Your complete name, you turn it again. You write your complete name. Say, God, as I'm writing my name on this candle, let me be favored. As you're writing that name, you are if it's John, you want to write, you write John. Say, John, as I'm writing my name, let John be favored. Let the son of, if your daddy's name is Ifani, let the son of Ifani, John, be favored. You, you just say your name. You pray on it. John, I want to be favored by men and women. Just write your full name. You turn it to that side, like full name. You turn it for the seven candle. You are going to write it like that. After that, this been to Sudan. Eh? You are going to you now open it like this. After you finish writing your name, you now place this been to Sudan in your hand like this. One, two, three. You can see it. There's it. In here, there's, I have it in my hand now. I will not rub it like this. As I'm rubbing, I'm praying from today. Let I am using the person's name on this card now to pray. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. So you are going to, if it's John, you are using to pray. And I say, John, I, John, let John be favored. John, so, 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 so. Eh? Like it's me now. Let me use my name now. Patience. Boniface Ephraim will be favored. Patient, as I'm using this bin to so that let patient Boniface Ephraim be favored. Let patient Boniface Ephraim be favored. Then you carry that candle. You face it to yourself. You have to face the earth to yourself. You draw that say, I am drawing wealth to myself. I am drawing joy to myself. I am drawing blessings to myself. Three times. You drop it again. You carry it like this. One, two, three. You can see it. You drop it again. Then you now turn it to the back like this and draw it to yourself. I am dropping, drawing wealth. That's how you will pray. Say, I am drawing wealth to myself. I am drawing peace to myself. I am drawing marriage to myself. I am drawing excess love to myself. Then you will now use it and pray. Say your intentions. What you want God to do for you. As you are under this candle, let light begin to shine. Let testimony begin to shine. Let, let men and women begin to notice you. Let money begin to come for your business. Then, what, what, will, what are you going to do with it? You will own the light. You will own the light. You can own it anytime you want to use it. But if you really want this to work for you very well, do it 12 o'clock, midnight. Do it 1 o'clock. The reason why I'm always saying people should do spiritual work like 1 o'clock midnight, because that is when the place is calm. Hmm? Inside is calm, but you see outside. Outside is not calm. Outside is busy. When you go out, you'll be seeing different, different types of spirits doing their own outside. I'm a living witness. I see them, so they cannot do many things. I don't find them trouble. Eh? So you use, you use the mouth like this. You pray that God, as I'm only this candle, let favor, let joy, let testimony begin to locate me. You own it. But if you know that you cannot do it 12 o'clock midnight, you can do it when you are at home. Just pray with the candle, then on it and keep. Please don't keep it where there's there's um just let it be far from the wall. You understand now? Don't keep it close to your curtain. Then that is how you do till the seven candle. 
Each day you will burn one. Each day you burn one till the seven candle is gone. Believe me, you have testimony. Then for this one, whenever you want to go out, hmm, whenever you want to go out, you will not open this. This is my perfume. You open it. You open it like this. Eh? You will fold this cover. You are going to fold this cover. Pour it into your bathing water. Then add salt to it. Pour it inside the bathing water and add salt to it. Whenever you know that you want to own this candle, you only do it in the morning when you are going out. Hmm? You only do it in the morning when you are going out or when you are at home. But when you are going out in the morning, you know you cannot own the candle. When you come back, you can do it. If you want to do it in the night, you can do it. If you want to do it in the morning, you can do it. You can own the candle and go out. Nothing will happen. Then, anytime you want to take your bed, I feel like this seven candle is consigned. Anytime you know you want to take your bed, after praying with this candle and on the light, you will not carry this semi-care perfume. You will use only one cover. You pour it inside your bathing water. Ask salt to it. Use it and pray. Ask for what you want. Bath and go out. Ah! You have testimony. You have excess testimony will come your way. Believe me, God will never fail you. God will never disappoint you. Things begin, things will begin to work for your favor. Things will begin to work for, for good. You begin to have joy. Then, if you want to go out, you can still use this that sign market perfume now, like this. You can add it in your hand like three times. Three times you rub it in your hand like this and place it in your face that oh, let me be favored in your clothes too. Let me be favored. Anywhere I go, I want favor. I want to sell my care today. You rub it in your leg that I want favor to locate you. After you are done bathing, please don't tower your body. Allow that to dry in your body. Believe me, by the grace of God, I shall smile with you. And whatever you are doing will come to pass. No spirit can ever stop you in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Remain blessed and please subscribe to my YouTube channel and share. Please don't forget to comment. God bless you. Amen.